how to delete files from a folder in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this advanced Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you an excellent way that will help you deleting files from folder based on a list in Microsoft Excel. Let's get started. <laughs> Take a look at this worksheet here. We have file name list in column A and we have name and extension. Okay. And we have a folder in desktop where we have all those files. Okay. Now, if I want to remove those files from Excel, how can you do that? Now, let's write here a.xlsx. Suppose this file is not in the folder. What will happen if we try to delete this? Also, we have this file. In that folder let me remove it so we have a list here and there are some files inside that folder that I don't want to remove so I removed it from here and there is a file that we just added that is not inside that folder what will happen to this okay now to solve this I'm going to use VBA and using VBA I will be able to delete files based on this list okay I have already created the code for you let me show you how you can use it click on the developer tab if you don't have the developer tab you can check out the link here click on visual basic click insert and click module now write the code i have already written the code it will be listed in the description and i'm going to close this and close the vv now if i click on macro and you can see we have our macro listed here delete files from list if i click on run it is asking for the folder from where you want to delete those files so my folder is in desktop and I'm going to select the folder. I'm going to click OK. And now it is asking for the range where you have the list that you want to delete. I'm going to select this. OK. Now here, let me clarify it again. We have one empty cell. We have a name that does not exist inside the folder. And we have another file in the folder. That name is not listed here. If I click OK, we have a pop up. Some files were not found and were left intact. OK. Now if I click OK, you can see in the list, all the file that has been deleted are removed from here. This file was not found in the folder, so it's intact just like it was here. And if I minimize this and go to that folder, all those files has been removed. Only this one wasn't removed because we didn't add this inside our list. Let's write the name again inside our list which was p and l dot xlsx remember you must write the name exactly it's inside your folder also you will have to give the file extension here the file extension is dot xlsx okay so we added the file here click on macro click on run again select the folder from where you want to remove all those files if i click ok asking for the range select the range and if i click ok you can see the one we just added is removed from the list and this one is not removed because there is no file in this name and in the folder we have removed everything okay in this way you will be able to remove a lot of file at once and also if you find it difficult to list all the file name and extension in column a i have created several tutorials on this where you will be able to extract file name from a folder. You can use that technique to list the file names you have on your folder and then from there you can remove specific files and keep your specific file and then if you run this code it will help you remove all those files from your folder. This is what I wanted to show you. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. If you can support the channel through Patreon and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Thanks for watching. And also if you need the code the link will be in the video description. Please check it from there.